I feel like my makeup collection is clinging on for dear life and it is, it's overflowing. It is ridiculous. The amount of PR that I've got recently has really put this to the test. So today I am going to be reorganizing everything. I've bought all of these new organizers. Some of them are old organizers that I already had and I rooted them out of the loft and I'm just, I'm going to do a whole new just redo of everything today because it really, really needs it. I do have a cold right now. I'm very sorry. I feel like my voice is so muffly and so disgusting. So I'm I'm sorry. But just before we do jump into this video, if you have not already, like and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And I'm trying to hit 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I think we can do it. I really think we can. We've still got to push, we got to push, but I really think that we can do that. This is going to be part one of possibly a two-part series. So today I'm going to be doing my cheeks and my everyday makeup drawer um, because I don't have enough storage, I don't think, for the rest of the collection. But tonight after work, I'm going to be going and getting some new stuff. So hopefully it works out. So let's see the cheek drawer because it's a mess. So you would have seen like an overview of this in the little intro that I did, but I actually didn't have all of my face palettes in that. And you can see just how bad this is. If I move some of the face palettes out of the way, you will see that everything is under here. It is crammed, it is crazy. But if I can try and do this, I do have Da, 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 da. that drawer over there you can see that is pretty much empty and I think I want that to be my makeup storage drawers just because this is my left hand side and that is my right hand side and I just feel like the right hand side would be so much easier to grab from so you know what I'm gonna do that Okay, that is all the cheek stuff out. I'm gonna move it to the other side and then we're gonna see, see how this is gonna go. <laughs> okay, so this is the new drawer. I'm not sure if you can see, it's a lot wider. So this is probably only like half of the whole thing. So that's good. What isn't good is my old storage actually can't fit. It's too long. Um, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do about that. So my whole thought was bronzer blush highlight face palettes, but I might have to go and get more storage because I don't know, I might have to get three more to do two bronzer, two blush, two highlight, and then face palettes. I think that's what's gonna be the best. However, I'm just gonna put things away. I'm gonna take these little tags off first, or maybe not because they are gonna be so difficult to get out. Um, we'll see, we'll just see how it goes. Okay, so straight away, these are too big to go in there, brilliant. When I say this was a nightmare, this was a nightmare. So basically most of my cheek products were way too wide to fit in these new organization drawers, which I actually didn't even think would be an issue, but here we go, <laughs> issues crop up wherever possible. And so it kind of made me have to put them in the other way, which to me just looks a little bit weird. I don't really want to have them the other way. I want everything neat. I want everything one way. I am a little bit of a perfectionist when it comes to things like this. And also my cheek palettes were a massive cause of concern as well. I had no idea what I wanted to do with my cheek palettes. I bought the bigger organization drawer specifically to put my cheek palettes in, but I just didn't know how to put it in or what to do. So you've seen there, my Odin's Eye little collection fit really nicely in one of my old organization drawers, which I love that part of this drawer. That is probably my favorite part of the drawer. And now you can see me trying to fiddle about with my face palettes. I have no idea what I was doing. I was just trying my best and hoping and praying to the makeup gods that it would be okay. But it, it just, it was not, it was just not working how I wanted it to work. You can see now at the back of these drawers where all of the like products that are too thick too thick, too wide. That's the one to fit in. They just look messy. It looks messy. I don't like it. I started to really regret this uh, around about now. I just wish I'd have left it alone, kept it how it was, but I kept going. 
this is what I'm looking like right now. I'm not sure if I love it in particular, but I think this is gonna be, hang on. Kind of like this maybe. So this might be my new cheek drawer. What do you think? I've kind of put all of my Odin's eye here. Then these are the face palettes. The drawer doesn't come out all the way. So there is some down here. Then I have bronzers, blush, highlight, and then a little bit of space to grow. I don't really know what I feel about it right now. I'm not sure. I do have this kind of organizer thing. So I'll see if I can put anything in here that just doesn't look right. But now I just feel like these are just randomly put there. I don't know. No, I think I have a better idea. Let, hang on, hang on. We're gonna <laughs> redo things again. So I knew I hated this um, and I think I was just gaslighting myself at this point because I was just like, no, I hate how this looks. I wish I could put it back, but I was determined to carry on and to try and find some kind of way of making it a little bit better. So my first thought was to put my face palettes in my old organization kind of draw things I don't know and that just didn't look right and it also blocked off that other organization thing behind it so I I like this look at this this is nice all of my face palettes at the side of the drawer and then I just decided I don't know why to just try and play about with my blushes I I can't tell you why I think it's because I just don't like how they were especially the like thicker ones at the back I just wanted them all to go in one way and to try and make them look a little bit better but then I ended up just giving up on that as well I think for now this is gonna have to be it I do have two more organizers here to grow um I am planning on growing a, a little bit of my collection quite soon so I don't know, maybe this is it. It's been a little bit of a struggle. I don't think I like it. I don't know, what do you think? This is like fine. I I think the issue is these aren't as wide as these. And so when I have like Odin's eye, for example, it can't fit in there because it's just too wide. But I do actually love this section, like my little Odin's eye collection. I love this section so much. So I don't know. It's, it's just gonna have to stay like this for now. What do you think? Here's like an overview of the drawer. Not loving it, but whatever. Next, now this, this drawer, oh my goodness me. This is my current everyday makeup drawer. And it, it's just, it's a lot, it's, it's ridiculous. But I did buy this the other day and I was thinking maybe this can be my new little everyday makeup drawer rack thing i don't know i don't know i'm just gonna try and put some stuff in here and hope for the best that is that's just what i'm gonna do right now i don't know <laughs> okay so all of this has to fit in here and what a good thing is i think um i am gonna be cutting down on project pans so a lot of these things will be going back in my main drawers and because of that, my main drawers will be more fleshed out. So that cheek drawer that has two massive organizers just completely clean. Um, hopefully more can go in that and it'll look a bit less weird. I don't know, but let's try and organize this. I'm thinking maybe like base and then eyes and lips. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see, who knows. <laughs> So I absolutely love this little organizer thing. I got it for about six or seven pound at Aldi and I just knew that I wanted this as my everyday makeup drawer storage because I just think it's so cute. I did actually end up switching some things around off camera after I finished this video. So as you can see here, I'm putting base and cheeks in the small compartment at the top, but afterwards I actually put cheeks at the bottom with eyeshadows and I actually ended up up putting lips on the top just because this was very top heavy in the end like you're gonna see in a minute everything is like crammed at the top and then like nothing is on the bottom so I just thought you know what I'm gonna change it up a little bit so 
whoopsies you're not gonna be able to see that there but i think this did the job really really well it's nice it's easy for me to grab all the things that i'm currently panning and currently trying to reach for as well and then the eyeshadow section at the bottom i was a little bit worried about this because i didn't know if everything was gonna fit but it actually fit really perfectly i really really love this actually it makes me really happy i currently have it on my desk and it's just oh it's so easy you know when you struggle for something for ages and then it suddenly just makes sense and it's so easy yeah okay what are we thinking of this i think this has come out really really good so i've got my base products here then cheeks and then on the lower section eye shadows and then some like overflow cheek and lips i think this is so much better than the mess that we had before what do you think i'm really happy with this i have no idea where i'm gonna put it maybe on my desk but I think this is really, really cool. Okay, I think this is where I'm gonna finish part one, just because I don't really have any other organization. I am gonna be doing my eye products and I am gonna be doing base as well. But like I said, after I finish in the office today, I am gonna be going and getting some more organization things but i just feel like this is going to be a lot better i feel like my collection was so crammed and this just feels nicer what do you think let me know all your thoughts and opinions down below in the comments did you like this video if you did like and subscribe and if you made it to the end of this video comment what is your dream makeup storage let me know give me some ideas <laughs> but this is it this is where i'm gonna love you and leave you today guys have an incredible day and I will see you tomorrow for a brand new video. Bye bye.